Maintain your distance. Act normal. No running, no jumping. Don't draw their attention. If they pay attention, they're more likely to notice flaws in the hologram. <laughs> A change of clothes. What is this? Some old spy cereal? What inattentive and brainless guard would be fooled by such a shabby disguise? The holographic shroud masks not only your clothes, but your face and fingerprints. It modulates your voice and sweetens your breath. Se acaba de meter el juego con una mecánica que inventaron prácticamente, ¿sabes? Esta gente. ¿Qué es? Chale, te has vestido como la RNC New Vegas, ¿vale? Eso quiere decir que obviamente eres de la RNC. Chale, estás vestido como un... Eh, eh, un este de la pólvora, un bandido de la pólvora. Eso es que pertenece a los bandidos de la pólvora. <risa> Me hace mucha gracia porque digo, no me has visto la cara en tu puta vida. Pero me tienes como aliado. Hola. ¿Cómo cojones va a endulzarte el aliento un holograma? Science, that's how. Ah, bueno, le daré buenos. Excellent. I'll contact you once you found a way to get to Stellar Bay. If you have any questions, come see me in my lab. And remember, don't trust the board. They'll try to win you over with promises of wealth and power, but it's a lie. The board's only interested in filling their own pockets. If we don't put a stop to them, they're going to run this colony to the ground. Transmission ended. If you are ready to depart, please select a destination on your navigation terminal. Okay. Okay. Okay, we.
Bye ever. Okay. Okay. Vale. A ver.
Make yourself at home, Captain. Lo haré, porque técnicamente estoy en casa. Hasta donde yo sé, no debería gotear, pero bueno. Remember that you are not insured. Checking your ship's manifest. Standard procedure. Welcome to Groundbreaker, by the by. Don't mind the heat. That's not the point. This hack would just knock out one of my workers. Yeah, with a toss ball stick, I heard you the first time. Hey, no offense, but I don't think this walking salt tuna can's gonna appreciate you interrupting. Keep talking, Millstone. See what happens. Now's not a good time. I'm dealing with a problem here. So, go space yourself. Problem solved. You must really want to trunch it through your teeth. Do what you want. I'm done here. Whatever you heard, it's all true. I had this foreman, right? Guy never liked me. Always trying to get a rise out of me. But I keep my chin up, right? Be the bigger man, I tell myself. He's a spacer's chosen man, though. So when the chosen beat my rangers the other night, my foreman comes swaggering up with his head full of boasting. That's when I broadsided him with a toss ball stick. Yeah. Look, this was a long time coming. Guy thinks he can push me around because he's some sky-high foreman and I'm just a back bay's dock worker. Well, former dock worker. Guess I just tendered my resignation. Enjoy my freedom. Scrounged together enough bits for a zero G. Other than that, can't say as I do. Hey, not for nothing. But I saw you wander out of that ship over there by the dock. Wouldn't happen to be yours, would it? Captain of the Unreliable. You're like something out of a serial drama. Hey, I don't want to talk your ears off, guessing you got places to be. I appreciate your time. Felix Millstone. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Hasta otra. See you around, boss. Just arrived? Head over to customs. Wheeler needs to process you. Hmm? 
If you've got a complaint, file it at security. Customs and inspection, right this way. Identification, please. Captain Hawthorne, you said. Let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. According to your ship's record, you've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit to lift it. You'll want to take it up with Udom Bedford, our board representative here on Groundbreaker. His office is located along the starboard wall of the promenade. Shines like a Byzantium commode. You can't okay. miss it. Access to that information is above my pay grade, and I've turned down three promotions, so it stays that way. I shouldn't be mentioning it, but what the hell? This here, impounding your ship, doesn't happen much. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations. If I had to take a guess as to why, you must have riled up someone important. You take the starch out of them, well, you won't hear any complaints from me. Oh, and if you're headed that way, would you mind doing me a favor? Wanda Dorset over in sickbay. Tell her the shipment's not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon, and if she'd be so obliged to get off my ass about it. A handful of Sam cleaning units retrofitted for surgery. I don't know much else. I stopped listening when she started yelling. Much appreciated. Is there anything else I can help you with? The fence. You'll find her in the rest and go. On your left when you enter the promenade. Make sure you bring an empty belly. Most places are on the promenade deck. Big door yonder, straight through security. There's a bar on the starboard side. I got a preference for the Lost Hope myself. Talk to Vera, she'll set you right. You need anything else? You let me know. Don't want anyone saying Groundbreaker's not the most hospitable port in the colony. Maybe. Most of the shipping traffic in the system passes through Groundbreaker. Every couple of months, we even get a big interstellar freighter. Two biggest operations are the board, that is, Halcyon Holdings and Sublight Salvage. But there are independent operators around the promenade deck. Most of those jobs are going to take you off station, though. Commandant Sanita might have a couple of folks she needs killed. Bad folks, I mean. Not, uh, not regular folks. 